Hello guys, welcome back to Bidding News TV. My name is Kofi Atinka. Atinka won. Then uh, Ghana will be playing against Nicaragua uh, on September 27th. That is 2022. That is the second World Cup pre uh, match and that's preparation match. And Ghana uh, will be looking forward to redeem themselves from that shameful defeat in the hands of the Brazilian side. And it's very difficult. It was it was very difficult game rather. But hey. I'll be giving you, as I've told you several times, that I, <laughs> that I mean, my spies are in the Black Stars camp. So I have senior journalists and senior colleagues in there who uh, always give me information, give me details and everything that goes on. Okay, so from the training schedule, from what happened against Brazil and what Otuad want to do, I'll be giving you the lineup. Okay, the lineup. Uh, there's 99.99 percent sure that this will be the line that Ghana will use against uh, that's uh, in Caragua. Okay, don't forget this is very news TV. The name is still remain Kofi Yatinka Tinka One. Subscribe to the channel, hit notification bell, share, like, and also comment. Don't forget that you like this very video and also you share to your friends. Now let's move on. You know the last time Ghana played against uh, Brazil, the starting lineup for the Ghanaian side. Was uh, George, George Walcott was in the post, the Amati and Juku at the center backs, Gideon Mensa, no, not no, Baba Raman, rather Baba Raman, and then so those are the right and left backs. Okay, then we have uh, Kudus and uh, Baba Idrisu, they are not uh, supposed to start, but he got injured during the warm up, so he did not start. So Baba Idrisu came in to replace him. Then Jordan Ayu, uh, at the uh, the right side of the attack, then Kamal Dean Suleiman at the left side. Then Afinajan was the arrowhead. But hey, this is how Ghana started. It was uh, because Baba uh, Pate got injured, it, it was switched to 4-1-4-1. Uh, okay, so when Ghana is uh, defending, 4-1-4-1, four one, four one, when they have the ball and they are moving, they move, uh, there's a 4-2-3-1. Uh, so that's how they started. But hey, things started falling. And Ghana considered uh, three goals in the first half of the game earlier. As early as 20 minutes, Ghana was down by two goals to nil. Okay, so uh, the quick changes in the first, uh, in the second half, I uh, saw uh, the Ghana side was stable. Okay, defending well, also start started to make some uh, approaches and some changes happen. So from the training schedule, from everything that I got from my senior men in, in the Blasters camp. This is going to be okay. Even uh, after the Brazil game, the Otuado said he made some mistakes uh, in the in the selection, and as going forward, he will select his players based on performance. Okay, so because of that, now from my checks and everything, the the, the one who be in the post will be uh, Richard Ofori. He will be in the post in in instead of uh, Jojo Walcott because hey, it's a friendly match and we are building something. Okay. Then the back, we will go back to the back three, okay? Three back. It's everybody now I've seen that Ghana will be good because of the materials we have uh, in our disposal for now. Three back will be good. So, Salisu, Juku, and Amate will be these three backs. And you will be going for there's a five midfielders, okay? So, the three back will be uh, Juku, Amate, then Salisu. Uh, Mohammed. Okay, then we go for the third back, Baba Rahman. Hey, Dev, Baba Rahman is inside at the left. Uh, that's a left wing back. And then so we will have uh, Kudus Mohammed and Baba Idrisu. And I will have Kofitre. Then Dennis uh, Odoi. So this will be how Ghana will line up. So Dennis Odoi, uh, Kofitre, Baba Idrisu, Kudus Mohammed. Then so uh, Baba Rahman. This will be the the the, the five at uh, the midfield. Okay, so when Ghana is attacking. Uh, Kofi Chere and Kudus Mohammed will join uh, the two up front there. That is in Nike Williams and Deda Ayu, so that uh, Odoi and Baba Rahman will have the opportunity to be like the ringers, okay, so that they can send in crosses and uh, other stuff. So when we lose the ball, then they will come back. Uh, Kofi Chere and Kudus Mohammed will join uh, that is, uh, Baba Idrisu at the midfield, then uh, Odoi and also. Baba Rahman will join them to be flat five. Then we have our three solid backs, Salisu, Kudus, uh, Salisu, uh, Juku, and Amate. Then up front two will be Andrew Dede Ayu and Inaiki Williams, as we saw in the second half of the game against Brazil. So definitely this is how Ghana is going to line up. Masa Dede Ayu is in the squad. Jordan Ayu will be in the bench. So let me go over again. It will be uh, Richard Foy in the post, 
uh, Salis Muhammad at three back, and also we have uh, Lazen Rajku, and we have Amati. These are our three back. Then we have Baba Rahman at the left side, that's a uh, left wing back, and we have Kudus, Baba Idrisu, Kofitre, and also we will have Dennis Odoi. Uh, so that's uh, because if you leave Baba Idrisu alone at the midfield, there, then trouble, trouble will come because. Uh, he is not all that good. He always prefer do, uh, pivot, okay, double pivot, so that uh, he can progress. So Kufitre can do that job. He can shield Baba Idris whenever he moves forward. Then we have uh, Dennis Odoi. So this is uh, the information I've gotten from the camp. This is my checks and everything that this will be the solid lineup for the Black Stars of Ghana against in Caragua. This is Bedi News TV. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit notification bell, share, like. Also comment. Thank you for your so sweet. Thank you very much.